A little reluctant to put the window down because it's a little chilly this morning. It's good British weather, that's why we're driving a Jaguar. This car was born out of the British countryside in this type of weather. Is it perfect though for the wet, slippery conditions? Yes, it's all wheel drive, so it's fine. Yeah, no problems. We needed to make up for the lack of ability for the driver. <laughs> well, it's, I mean, we've been doing this for quite a few years and it's never ever been like this before, so it's pretty challenging, I must say. <laughs> Where has your husband gone? He's hiding in the car. Is he? Who can blame him? Who can blame him? What, here you go. Come on to the umbrella with me. Um, isn't this nice? It's, it makes things rather cosy, doesn't it? It makes things very different and very cosy as well, yeah. <laughs> for sure. Tell me about the day you've had out there today. Well, the morning was a bit challenging, but this afternoon has been absolutely awesome. We've had a really great afternoon. I only got two penalty points over four stages, so we're really, really pleased with this afternoon. Are we looking forward to tomorrow a little more than today, perhaps? Uh, I think we are, actually. <laughs> I think we're looking forward to tomorrow much more than we did today. from yesterday. Absolutely, very different day from yesterday. We had to go and try and find that car this morning. To <laughs> in the car park, up, In the yeah. car park covered with snow so that was a pretty good start to the day wasn't it? Yeah and so then he lifted the back hatch and all the snow that was on the roof fell into my helmet and filled my helmet with snow. That's not good. Did you guys make a snowman? I came past the car park this morning and nearly every car had a snowman on it. No, we couldn't find a carrot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah no snowman today, maybe tomorrow. Tell me about this Mansfield stage as well. Maybe a driver stage, Chris had a said, it was pretty much flat out. It was a driver stage, it was fantastic, you realise how good the car is. Yeah, but from a navigator's point of view, she mixed up the RTZ and started too soon, so that was a bit of a sad story in our life, but anyway, you get that. We won't talk about that. We won't we talk still, about that. We still love each other, it's yeah. okay, <laughs> no problems. Talk to the Scotchman. Oh, I can go home. No, that's okay. We love you too. It's all right. What a foggy hill. It was really bad. We had to slow down, but we made it. We had a good time. I hear there was cake today. There was it's one cake. piece. There was cake we have today. photographic evidence. We have cake. They lifted their game a bit. Marimba was great this morning, but unlike some people, Jamison and Ilden just aren't our favourite stages. And so we just didn't push it. The car's absolutely awesome for these rides. And we have had a great weekend. I mean, the snows was very challenging and it, it meant that at times we were actually stuck at Pension Grimace and couldn't get out. It's going to be a memorable event for the very reason that, you know, running a targa in such a snowy environment always makes for good conversations and so forth. And it, it does present some new challenges and lots of wet stages, so it will go down in memory as, as being quite a different event. A good way to finish the 10th anniversary and we'll get our plate, so that's good. <laughs> <laughs>